Let's talk about mortgage lending. So at the beginning of the year, I did see a stat that said up to 30% of the thousand largest IMBs in the U.S. are going to be gone by the end of 2023. We're seeing that happen. So do you think that we're on pace or ahead of pace to see that number ultimately get hit? I think we're on pace. You know, I think in the uh, in this banking and financial sector, there is a massive consolidation happening. You know, it's very similar to what we saw in 2020 when small businesses and medium businesses were consolidated into larger businesses because a lot of them were shut down, right, uh, through lockdowns where you had big box stores that were allowed to stay open and people shopped on Amazon. So the market share just went to the bigger box stores and to Amazon. Same thing is kind of happening in the financial industry, whether it is in the banking system, whether it is, you know, when it comes to lending, you know, I think um, similar to what we saw in 2008 to 2009, there were, I mean, do you remember Washington Mutual going under to that bank, which did a ton of lending, you know, fun fact, I used to bank with them and had a mortgage with them at that stage. So it was an interesting time for sure. But all of them got consolidated. So it's, you know, I'm seeing a lot of similar similarities. Um, wow. The the scale is just so much bigger. And that's why, you know, I shared that it's probably the biggest ones, you know, in the past 80 to 100 years. Yeah, it's definitely the big squeeze coming. I, th I think we can see that in a lot of different sectors right now.